Hello everyone, I'm Bonita from Pennies to Dollars, and today I thought it would be fun to take you with me on a few of the chores that I do around the house and decorating for Christmas. I'm using things that I already have, I'm using things that I treasure and that I love, and every season when I pull them out, it doesn't feel like I'm getting nothing new. It feels like a treasured memory that's coming out of the box. We have square bales stored under this tarp to keep them dry. I'm going to go feed the donkey. He normally honks because he wants fed every day at five o'clock but I'm gonna do it early today because it's getting dark by five o'clock. Last year, I paid a crazy price to get some hay. No one had any because it was so dry and because of all the fires that we had had. And so I baled my own prairie grass this year on the farm with the help of my nephew. And I have two big round bales coming at the first of the year that he's going to deliver for me once these square bales are gone from last year. We still have a lot of green grass growing and green weeds that he would eat, but in his pen, he doesn't. And yes, I could let him out, but donkeys are stubborn. And if he decides he's not going back in, it takes about three people to get him back in with somebody leading him with a cracker and he'll take a bite of a cracker and take a step and he'll take another cracker and take a step so he knows the game and you can go through a lot of crackers if he's gotten even a hundred feet from the pen and even the donkey is staying out of the dripping water today <laughs> over the winter i just use the planters that i have outside as compost bins and this is just coffee and eggshells. I have two different old bathtubs that I use as elevated planters. And then I just use a piece of wood to break down the shells. I have found that this helps not only my flowers, but my vegetables really thrive. And so I do not throw out my shells and my coffee grounds. I just mix them in and let them disintegrate and enrich the soil. Give them a good turnover, get them mixed in, let them break down on their own. You can see I've got brown ones in there too. We also burn our own trash. This is just an old 50 gallon oil drum that we got from a local mechanic shop. We cut the tops out and we burn our trash in it. And like I've told you before, I use cat food bags as my trash liners. I reuse them unless they get real messy. And we just use an old oven grate to keep the ashes or anything from flying out and starting a fire. Of course, it's not going to right now because we have a lot of snow and dripping going on right now. You can probably hear it behind me as the snow is still melting. It's just too foggy and drippy today with all the snow melting to hang the clothes on the line. So I will be forced to use the dryer because we've been like this now for about a week. So I like to keep my office a little festive and this is a tea light that I picked up at the Dollar Tree. They are three for a dollar twenty-five by the solar bulbs. And then I put some little holly 
and some little plant hangers that are Santa Claus here. I just love those. They are an old Avon thing that I've had for years. I have some little angels that are also plant hangers. One more little Santa Claus and just some festive tea towel and ribbon and a festive handkerchief. And again, a little tea light from the Dollar Tree. And a green blanket that I had and a pillow that I already had for my office. 